just had three college presidents go before Congress. Uh, they largely failed to unequivocally condemn this sort of thing. One of them has already resigned. Do you think Yale has done enough to curb this type of well, I, I, I think that's a good question also. You know, uh, the president of Yale unequivocally denounced what happened here. And I commend Peter Salve for his moral clarity, which was so lacking on the part of those university presidents who testified before Congress. You know, what happened here doesn't depend on its context. It was condemnable, unconscionable. And we need all of us to say it out loud. Not just to think it, not shy away, not deny, but to say it out loud. And on the federal law, if that act had been to incite violence, <coughs> if the intent had been to create violence, it might be a hate crime. So I'm very glad that the New Haven police are continuing to do fact-finding and have been in touch with federal authorities. I spoke earlier today with uh, my staff and we are going to contact federal authorities simply to make them aware of it. But I'm very confident that the New Haven police are going to investigate thoroughly and capably here.